It's Wednesday, so it's time for Baby Matters. This week, we're heading back to our friends at the Natural Birth House to discuss laboring positions. In the movies, when women go in and labor, they show up at the hospital, they lay on their back, and they kind of wait for labor to happen. Midwife Kara Kanya says don't women wait. don't realize lying on your back in labor actually slows down the process and makes labor more painful. We really promote more natural techniques for comfort measures for labor, which helps labor go faster and, and smoother. We have access to her back where we can apply some comfort measures here. She explains upright positions make laboring easier for mom and baby. A lot of people don't realize like baby is actively trying to be born. Babies are constantly shifting themselves to go through the pelvis. And if we help them by getting upright and working with gravity and switching positions, our pelvis can help move and help the baby slip on down a little bit easier. Kyra even went on to name a few popular upright use, positions for labor. Upright laboring positions is more than just walking. You can sit, you can squat, there's birth balls and other tools that you can use to help labor move along faster. The stairs at the hospital or at your house are really great tools that you can use in an upright position. Um, but one of the most common ones, especially in my practice, is a hands and knees position. She tells me moms deliver in pretty so much any position that's comfortable for them. But if you are laboring in a hospital, most doctors will prefer you give birth while lying on your back. It doesn't mean flat on your back. The beds do semi-recline, so moms can deliver in like a semi-reclining position. But for the delivery itself in the hospital, they typically deliver on their back. And we can't forget about water births when discussing labor. Kyra explains that moms have to be healthy and low risk. It's actually a preferred option at the birth house. Because you're feeling lighter, if you've got enough space in the birthing tub, you can do all kinds of positions. Many of them you couldn't even do outside of the tub. It's a lot easier to lay on your left side. You can squat more gently without having so much pressure on your bottom. Kyra says while water births aren't really an option in hospitals here in Acadiana, there's another way to reap the benefits of water. At the hospital, they can labor in the shower. So that is an upright laboring position. You can even bring the birth ball into the shower at the hospital and sit on the birth ball in an upright position and receive the benefits of water in labor. All right, I hope these laboring tips helped. Make sure to tune in next Wednesday for Baby Matters. Stay with us. We'll be right back after this break.